Fire. Look for the smoke. We're on our way. <laughs> Laura, you made it. Sam. Um, Thank goodness. Surprise. <laughs> it's okay. He's one of us. Sorry if I startled you. This place would make anyone a little jumpy. We just spoke to your crew. They're on their way. Look, he bandaged my foot. <laughs> oh, it was the least I could do. My manners. I'm sorry, I'm Matthias. A teacher by trade. Not really cut out for island life, I'm afraid. <laughs> Sweetie, you look exhausted. Sit down. Yeah. Sam here was just telling me about the Sun Queen. Right. Himiko. Can you tell me more? I'm intrigued. Well, believe it or not, a couple thousand years ago, Queen Himiko pretty much ran things in Japan. <laughs> she loves telling this story. Himiko was beautiful, enigmatic, but also ruthless and powerful. Legend says she had shamanistic powers. And this is where she loses me. Well, there's always some truth to miss. She commanded an army of samurai warriors, her magnificent storm guard. They rode the very winds into battle, laying waste to all who opposed them. They say the sun rose at Himiko's command, and she ruled everything its rays touched, from the mountains to the sea and beyond. <sighs> but what happened to her?
Neko. It's good to see you, little bird. I'm so glad you're here. Is Sam with you? She was with you. She was here with that man, Matthias. But I passed out. When I woke up, they were both gone. You girls should Nico one time off. We need to find them. No, uh, wait, wait, wait. What about Raw? Okay, let's split up. One of us go with Laura and meet up with Raw. The rest of us should fan out and look for Sam. I'll go with her. No, no. Le uh, let me. You know how to use one of these? It's, it's been a while. It, it's all coming back to me. Get to Roth. We'll find Sam and this Matthias guy. <laughs> you, you're gonna be okay? Yes, I... Oh, we just need to rest for a few minutes. <sighs> You sit, uh, you sit here. I'll, uh, <clears throat> I'll check up ahead. Okay. Not too bad. How do I start? Okay. This is Lara Croft. An archaeologist from the Endurance, shipwrecked on an island in the... on an expedition to find the homeland of my ancestors. And ever since I told Lara the story of Himiko years ago, she's been hunting for its location. I never really gave it much thought that any of this could actually be real history. My grandmother used to tell me the story like it was a memory. Many thousands of years ago, Queen Himiko ruled the land of Yamatai. The sun rose at Himiko's command and she ruled everything its rays touched, from the mountains to the sea and beyond. But one day, Yamatai simply disappeared without a trace. Forgotten in time. Lara's having a crisis of confidence, so for her sake, I'll keep up a happy face. But something about this expedition has been making me nervous. I have butterflies in my stomach. 
As we sail closer to the Dragon's Triangle, I'm starting to feel nauseous. And this isn't the excited kind of nerves. What the hell is wrong with me? I should be excited. This trip is going to be awesome. I just need to shake off this feeling. Maybe I can convince Lara to take a break and have a drink with me. Another shrine. Who are they worshipping? Whitman is such a drama queen. I can't believe the hissy fit he threw during the filler shoot. I mean, this is his job, right? It's not like he's offering anything to the actual research part of this expedition. Once we find Yamatai and the cameras are rolling, he'll calm down. He might be a total pain in the ass, but he knows how to work a scene. I just need to do my job and keep my cool. Laura doesn't know it, but I've been shooting footage of her too. I really want to make sure she gets the credit she deserves. And besides, she looks great on film. I think she's a natural. That's probably gonna drive Whitman out of his mind with jealousy. But by the time he finds out, we'll be enjoying the premiere in Telluride. <laughs>